Brittany Miller, welcoming you to the graduate program in the Department of Biological Sciences at Simon Fraser University. We are going to explore the research in the department that emphasizes ecology, evolution, and biological conservation. Let's take a look around. SFU is proud of our programs in evolutionary biology and ecology. Today we will meet people applying basic concepts of ecology and evolution to diverse topics in conservation biology, evolutionary medicine, and so much more. I am a pollination ecologist. My students and I study things as different as how selection by pollinators leads to evolution of plant mating systems and reproductive isolation between different plant populations. Pollination is super important. Almost 90% of flowering plants need a pollinator, an animal, in order to reproduce. So without pollinators, we would have no plant reproduction. And that's one of the things that we study. Why do 60 plus percent of plant populations fail to reproduce in any given year. I'm involved in a very large research program with my graduate students studying aquatic ecology and conservation. Well our main interest is asking very fundamental questions about uh, ecology of fish and fish populations and how that information can be used to improve conservation and sustainability of the fish themselves and also of their habitats. Our particular interest is in salmon, where we are asking how the nutrients from their carcasses are fertilizing the streams and the adjacent forests and how that affects other species, everything from plants to insects to birds. I'm a member of the uh, Department of Biological Sciences here at SFU. And in, in my laboratory we study uh, uh, animal communication systems, particularly insect communication systems. In addition to that, we are interested in the type of cues insects utilize to find a resource. So what cues are they exploiting when they try to find a plant, either to feed on uh, the nectar that plant provides or the plant they want to actually uh, eat? I study a range of problems in freshwater ecosystems. So these are lakes, rivers, streams. Our department is a pretty exciting place to be a graduate student. We, we always have the bigger picture. We want to understand nature, how, how nature works. It's these things that inspire us to do our work and that make it really relevant in terms of things like food security and also the conservation of natural areas. Here at SFU, we enjoy a hands-on, interactive approach to our research. Come be a part of our dynamic graduate program at Simon Fraser University. We look forward to working with you.